Hello, I'm Yi Shang from HarbinMandarin.com. In this lesson, we are going to learn the most useful phrases for Chinese beginners. When you are first learning Chinese, it can feel like everyone is speaking so fast. Maybe they are. When that happens, you can say, 请慢一点说, please speak a little slower. 请 means please. 慢 means slow. 一点 means a little. Note that the N in 点 is silent. And 说 means speak. Please slow a little speak. In other words, please speak a little slower. Please repeat after me. 请慢一点说. 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 Please speak a little slower. Let's see an example. 你好,你叫什么名字?你来自哪儿? That was too fast. 请慢一点说. Please speak a little slower. 好,好,你好,你叫什么名字? That's much better. 我叫一爽. 你来自哪儿? 我来自中国. Problem solved. I really love that actress. Okay, moving on. If you didn't quite catch what someone said, you can say 请再说一遍. Please say it again. 请 means please. 再 means again. 说 means say. And 一遍 means one time. Please again say one time. In other words, please say it again. Please repeat after me. 请再说一遍. 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 Please say it again. Let's watch those amazing actors again. 你真漂亮! I didn't catch that. 请再说一遍. Please say it again. 你真漂亮! This time I got it. He said I'm really beautiful. 请再说一遍。你真漂亮! <laughs> okay. When you want to ask how to say something in Chinese, you can ask by saying the word or phrase you want to know and add 用汉语怎么说, which means how do you say it in Chinese. For example, happy 用汉语怎么说, how do you say happy in Chinese? 用 means using. 汉语 means Chinese. 怎么 means how. And 说 means say. X using Chinese how to say. In other words, how do you say X in Chinese? Please repeat after me. 用汉语怎么说? 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 How do you say it in Chinese? Jack, how do you say I love you in Chinese? I love you 用汉语怎么说? I love you 是我爱你我爱你一爽谢谢我也爱你 Thank you, I love you too. Okay. If you want to know what a Chinese word or phrase means, you can ask by saying the word or phrase followed by 是什么意思. For example, if you want to know what the word 老师 means, you can say 老师是什么意思? What does 老师 mean? 是 is the verb to be, 什么 means what, and 意思 is meaning. X is what meaning? In other words, what does X mean? Please repeat after me. 是什么意思? 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 What does it mean? 我喜欢你的眼睛. He likes my what? What are 眼睛? 眼睛是什么意思? What does 眼睛 mean? 眼睛 are eyes. 
我喜欢你的眼睛。I like your eyes. 谢谢 ，Thank you. Okay. If you want to ask if someone can speak English, you can say 你会说英语吗 ？Can you speak English? 你 means you. 会 means can. 说 means speak. 英语 means English. And ma is a yes/no question particle. 你会说英语吗？你会说英语吗？你会说英语吗 ？Can you speak English? 你好，你好。I want to find a good restaurant near here, but I'm not sure how to ask. Um, 你会说英语吗 ？Can you speak English? 会 ，Yes, I speak English. Oh, can you recommend a good restaurant near here? Sure, I'd be happy to. Problem solved. Aren't they cute? Okay. If someone asks if you know Chinese, you might want to tell them that you can speak a little Chinese. 我会说一点汉语。I can speak a little Chinese. 我 means I. 会 means can. 说 means speak. 一点儿 means a little. And 汉语 means Chinese. 我会说一点儿汉语。我会说一点儿汉语。我会说一点儿汉语。I can speak a little Chinese. Can you speak Chinese? 我会说一点汉语。你会说汉语吗 ？Can you speak Chinese? 我也会说一点汉语。I can speak a little Chinese too. Okay. If someone says something you didn't understand, you can say 我没听懂。我 means I. May is used to negate an action that happened in the past. In this case, it means didn't. Ting means listen or hear, and dong means understand. So, 我没听懂 means I didn't understand what I heard. Please repeat after me. 我没听懂。我没听懂。我没听懂。I didn't understand what I heard. In Chinese, we make a distinction between understanding something you heard and understanding something you saw or read. If you want to say you didn't understand something you saw or read, you can replace 听 listen with 看 which means to see or read. So 我没看懂 means I didn't understand what I saw or read. Please repeat after me. 我没看懂。我没看懂。我没看懂。I didn't understand what I saw or read. 今天很冷。I didn't get it. 我没听懂。今天很冷。It's cold today. 是啊，非常冷。Yeah, very cold. This is so hard to understand. 我没看懂。Okay. Sometimes when someone asks you a question, you don't know the answer. In that case, you can say 我不知道 I don't know. 我 means I. 不 means not, and 知道 means to know. 我不知道。我不知道。我不知道。I don't know. 他是医生吗 ？Is he a doctor? 我不知道。I don't know. Okay. If you need someone to wait for you for a moment, you can say 请等一会儿 Please wait a moment. 请 means please. 等 means wait. 
and 一会儿 means a moment. 请等一会儿。请等一会儿。请等一会儿。Please wait a moment. 咱们走吧。Let's go. Oh, I need to find my keys. 请等一会儿。Please wait a moment. Okay. To say thanks in Chinese, you say 谢谢 Please repeat after me. 谢谢谢谢谢谢 Thanks. 一爽，这是给你的。This is for you. 谢谢 Thank you. To say you are welcome in Chinese, you say 不客气 Or 不用谢 Please repeat after me. 不客气，不客气，不客气 You are welcome. Or 不用谢，不用谢，不用谢 You are welcome. Jack, 这是给你的 Jack, this is for you. 谢谢 Thank you. 不客气 You are welcome. Or I could have said 不用谢 Isn't that actress amazing? Okay. If you make a big mistake, you can apologize by saying 对不起 which means I'm sorry. Please repeat after me. 对不起对不起对不起 I'm sorry. So where? Ouch! Oh, 对不起 I'm sorry. For smaller mistakes, like if you dial a wrong phone number or lightly bump into someone, you can say 不好意思 which also means I'm sorry, but it's a lighter apology. Please repeat after me. 不好意思不好意思，不好意思。I'm sorry. My dad is there. Hi, 爸爸。Hello, Dad. 我不是你爸爸。I'm not your dad. Oh, 不好意思。I'm sorry. I thought he was my dad. Okay. If someone apologizes to you. And you want to say it doesn't matter, don't worry about it. Then you can say 没关系 or 没事儿 Please repeat after me. 没关系没关系没关系 It doesn't matter or 没事儿没事儿没事儿 It doesn't matter. So where? Ouch! Oh, 对不起 I'm sorry. 没关系 It doesn't matter. You can tell someone that something is not a problem by saying 没问题 You can say 没问题 if someone asks a favor from you, asks you to wait for a bit, or tells you that they are going to be late to let them know it's not a problem. Please repeat after me. 没问题没问题，没问题 ，no problem. Hi, Jack. 你明天忙吗 ？Are you busy tomorrow? 我明天有汉语考试。I have a Chinese exam tomorrow. 好吧 ，OK. 你能帮我复习一下吗 ？Can you help me review? 没问题 ，no problem. Okay, here are some commonly used Chinese greetings. Hello in Chinese is 你好，你 means you, 好 means good. Together, this is how we say hello in Chinese. Please repeat after me. 你好，你好，你好 ，hello. When someone says 你好 to you, all you need to do is say 你好 back. 
，你好 ，Hello， 你好 ，Hello。When you see someone in the morning, you can greet them by saying 早上好。早上 means morning, and 好 means good. 早上好 means good morning. Please repeat after me. 早上好。早上好。早上好。Good morning. 早上好 is a polite way of saying good morning. You can also just say. 早 as a more casual way of saying good morning. Please repeat after me. 早早早 Good morning. When people say 早上好 or 早 to you, all you need to do is say 早上好 or 早 back. 早上好 Good morning. 早 Morning. When you want to say goodbye in Chinese, you can say 再见。再 means again， 见 means see， so 再见 means see you again or goodbye. Please repeat after me. 再见，再见，再见。Goodbye. Again, when someone says 再见 to you, all you need to do is say 再见 back. Oh no! It's late. I have to go home. 再见 Goodbye. 再见 Goodbye. When it's time to go to bed, you can tell your family or friends 晚安 which means good night. 晚 means night, and 安 means safe or peaceful. So 晚安 means have a peaceful night. In other words, good night. Please repeat after me. 晚安，晚安，晚安。Good night. Again, when someone says 晚安 to you, all you need to do is say 晚安 back. Oh, 晚安 ，Good night. 晚安 ，Good night. Okay. That's all for this lesson. Did you enjoy this lesson? Please click like below and leave me a comment. If you are interested in my private Chinese lessons, please visit my website harbinmandarin.com and send me a message. I'll see you guys next time. 再见。